I don't know what I'm doing. And I don't even know what to fucking talk about. I need a life. Hey lovelies, welcome back to my channel. So today I decided I would do like a little get ready with me chit chat sort of video. And I've already done my base and everything like that so I'm going to really quickly do my lips first. So I'm just going to go on with a like, tiny little used pencil that I've had for ages and line my lips out with that. So I'm just going to like not talk while I do this real quick. I really want to get into doing my makeup on camera and sort of becoming more of a beauty channel rather than a dreadlock channel like I originally started. I mean, I've still got a couple more videos I want to make to do with dreads. I've been doing my makeup like I said in another video. I've been doing it since I was like 14 which is 10 years and literally every day I would get up and the first thing I would do is put on my face and it got to the point where I didn't even really know what I looked like without makeup on. If you watch my story time video, you know that I've recently just looked after my granddad. He had brain cancer, ended up passing away in February of this year. So when I was living with him, I, you know, would have to shoot out to the supermarket or whatever. And like I used to put my makeup on just to go to the supermarket because I just didn't want people to see me without it. So I stopped doing it. And my skin got a whole lot better, it got a whole lot clearer. I started to accept the fact that I actually look okay without makeup on. It was nice to finally decide for myself that I looked okay without it. Speaking of that, I'm about to pack a whole bunch of shit on my face. So that's one thing I wanted to talk to you guys about. Actually, I've just ordered like a whole bunch of makeup off Wish and most of it was like free, just pay for shipping sort of thing. So I'm not expecting like super high quality stuff, but I feel like it'll still be reasonable and I can make it work. So I want to do like a Wish haul video, which I think would be awesome and maybe like a first impression and do like a full face of makeup with everything that I bought. So if you want to see that video, then like this one and you know, just let me know in the comments if you'd enjoy that video and then I will definitely post it. And if you hit that little notifications button, then you will know every time I upload a new video. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Okay, so I'm going to get started with this makeup. So first off, I'm going to start with white. I'm just going to go into my inner corner with this. So this is just like a designer brand's palette. And I'm pretty sure the one that I ordered off Wish is going to be like a similar product. So I'm thinking I might do this gold first. And I'm just going to apply that to the inner half of my eyelid and I'm just kind of like patting that colour in where I want it I'm just going to like keep using it and see if I can build on it kinda oh yeah so I just posted that video of me doing a cover of Rap God by Eminem and I don't know what happened. I don't, I don't know, maybe I was nervous. Like, I don't sing or rap in front of people or anything like that, so... I don't, maybe I was just scared. It was fun filming it anyway. It'd be cool to get into doing some more covers and things like that. Like, I know you really aren't only meant to have sort of one niche on YouTube. You know, like, only do makeup or only do this, whatever. I just like a whole bunch of different things. I'm into makeup, I'm into tattoos, I'm into dreadlocks and all of that sort of thing, so... Why can't I post about all of them? I don't see why not. Let me know if you have a problem with me posting heaps of different videos, different content, that sort of thing. Um, one person suggested like a good deeds sort of thing, which would be pretty cool. Just get people to comment, you know, one good deed and I don't know, I need to work out how I would do it, but I feel like that'd be pretty cool and it gets, you know, like more goodness out in the world. I'm using the screen as my mirror. My mirror's down there but it's a bit too low. So, <laughs> duh, this has a mirror. I'm so, like, I'm naturally blonde. <laughs> okay, okay, here we go. I love this pink. It's so pretty. Okay, this doesn't look horrible. I mean, it doesn't look good, but it doesn't look horrible. Okay, so, I'm just cleaning my brush off on my hand. On my arm, as you do. When I'm blending colours, I don't really like to clean the brush too much because that's sort of the whole point, you want colours to blend together. So next I'm going to go over with like this kind of rosy gold sort of colour and use that to kind of put 
in the middle and just like, I don't know, kind of blend those colors together. I'm going to go in with this kind of like dark coppery gold sort of color and I'm going to put this in the crease. I don't hate this. Just get my brush and just like wipe off all that fallout. And for underneath, I'm thinking I'm gonna go in with this dark kind of aquary blue. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna apply some black pencil liner to my waterline. Next up is eyeliner. You know when you start off with one line and then you have to like build it up and build it up because you keep mucking it up and then you end up with like pretty much black all over your eye. Yeah that just happens. Oh fuck my life. I've done my wings and applied my mascara <laughs> so next up I'm going to show you real quick how I do my lips using eyeshadow and just a nude lipstick so I went ahead, went ahead and applied my Avon lip plumping conditioner in the colour nude uh, so my lips are like tacky a little sticky you know and Okay, I'll show you with this bright colour first. So, pick up the product, make sure there's plenty on the brush, and then just... Like, who actually said you had to use lipstick on your lips and eyeshadow on your eyes? Fuck the system. Okay, that's not looking too bad. So, okay, it looks ridiculous actually, but next I'm just gonna go in with like this sort of peachy pink color and just like pat that in the middle. Okay, we're gonna work with this. Just gonna apply a little bit more of that dark print to the outer corners black all over my hand. I did my sister-in-law's Halloween makeup today. It's Halloween today. I should have done something scary. Oh, this is actually kind of scary, so yeah. That counts, right? But yeah, I did my sister-in-law's Halloween makeup, so I got like makeup everywhere because that's my style. <clears throat> okay, yeah, so now just real quick, I am going to go in with some highlighter. So I'm using the Chi Chi palette. And yes, we have Unicorn and Mermaid. But I think today I might go for, just like wiping my hands on my pants, make sure they're clean. And I'm just going to go in with the sunshine colour. Now this is like a cream concealer. A concealer? What the fuck am I talking about? See, I don't know what I'm doing. This is a cream highlighter and I've got a hair in it so I'm just pulling that off. Okay. And I'm just going to like dab this on right on the top of my cheekbone. Ooh, give me a little bit more. You can never, you, we can have too much highlight, but you can never have too much highlight. Fuck those people. I actually kind of feel like a Barbie doll with the, you know, the, like the pink and the blue. Pretty. So I'm just going to take that same colour and put a little dot on my nose and a little bit down the bridge, a little bit on my forehead. I'm just kind of blend that in a little. Basically just like all the high points of your face is where you want to highlight. Blend that in, a little bit down here. Glowing for the gods. Okay, I'm just like cleaning that off my hands and I'm just going to kind of like blend that in a little. As if I know what I'm doing. So yeah, that was my chit chat get ready with me. I'm still in my pyjamas and I'm probably going to spend the day in them. I try and post at, definitely at least once a week. Um, lately I've been posting two or three times a week because it's fun and I'm bored and I have nothing else to do and you guys are my only friends so please subscribe 
Oh, I also want to do like a dreadlock hairstyle tutorial for anyone who's interested in seeing that. So that might even be one of my next videos. I don't know. I'll see how I go. I like it. I mean, the lips are a little trashy, but... And I don't know what the transfer's like with this, so I'm just going to... A little bit, but not too bad. I feel like you'd be able to drink out of your glass and there wouldn't be too much come off, you know what? Yeah, a little. But they're still pretty pink. And they match my eyes. I do like the blue and the pink together. I think that's really pretty. That looks good. So, finished result. The winged liner is just ridiculous. This is one of the worst winged liners I've ever done. I don't know, I guess this kind of works for the look. Like, it's not even straight. I don't know what's happening. I'm losing my mind. Okay, I'll stop wasting your time. Bye, guys.